talking about choosing an appropriate light to grow your plants with. Um, there are two types of light. Well, actually, there are several lights on the market, but the two different spectral outputs that you can look for would be the blue light or a metal halide light or the red light or the high pressure sodium light. Uh, the first light that I mentioned helps to promote growth of the plants. So if you're trying to start seeds and grow plants, then you'll go ahead and use the blue light. Uh, if you want to go ahead and flower plants and put off fruit and vegetables or, 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 or flowers, then you'll go ahead and use the red light. Um, there are several different lights that you can choose from. Some of the more uh, conventional ones would be the T12 fluorescent. You'd use either the cool light or the warm light to give you both either the flowering or the vegetative growth. The only problem with this is, is the amount of height that you can get. You can grow a plant up to about eight inches of, with these types of lights and then they're pretty much uh, ready to go outside or do something else with them. Um, another new, new light that have, has come out would be the compact fluorescent light. Um, it's a series of tubes with the ballast built in and like I said, um, you'd get either the uh, 64K full spectrum light to grow your plants with for vegetative growth or you'll go ahead and get the 2700 uh, Kelvin, uh, that's the temperature rating, to go ahead and flower your plants with. That'll be your red light. Um, another uh, fluorescent light that's come out on the market which is very, very powerful would be your T5 light and it comes in both the um, red spectrum and the blue spectrum. These bulbs put off about 5,000 lumens per bulb, whereas the conventional T12 would have put out about 1,200 lumens, so they're about five times the uh, lumen output of one of the uh, original bulbs. Um, then you, uh, if you need more light, then you'll go ahead and uh, move to uh, the high intensity discharge lights. These lights here use uh, gas and they ignite the gas in order to put off a different spectral output. Um, like I said earlier, uh, you have the uh, metal halide or the blue color light to start your plants and then you use a high pressure so sodium light or the red color light in order to flower your plants to put off flowers which in turn will put off fruit and vegetables or flowers whatever you so des desire. Um, there's uh, other lights that they have on the market some that have reflectors built in uh, some that's a full spectrum light that has both the red and the blue built into it so instead of having to use two different lights you can go ahead and use one light. Uh, you can find them in both the uh, HIDs and the uh, fluorescent lights.